The wife of the national chairman of the People's Democratic Party, Hajar Chief Mrs. Fatima Bamangatuku, the amazing Amazon and beautiful princess from Baramatu Kingdom in Nigeria's Niger Delta region, glided gracefully into the prestigious League of the Golden People when she clocked 50 years on the surface of the earth, looking a whole lot younger by many years. 50 years in sound health, good company, and very promising future should call for a huge celebration. And that was indeed what Princess Hajia Chief Mrs. Fatima Mbamangatuku was given. Friends she had cultivated over the decades from across the country put heads together to organize a well-packaged event in commemoration of our golden age. The International Conference Center Abuja, venue of the event, was a heavy beehive of men and women who called the shots in all facets of national life. Of course, since the center of attraction in the celebration is the soulmate of the national chairman of the ruling party of Africa's most populous country, politicians from all political parties who have benefited from the huge influence and political tutelage of Dr. Bamanga Tukur over the years, regrouped to pay their unflinching allegiance to the Grand Master of Nigerian politics, the global villager who had put the People's Democratic Party, PDP, and the international searchlight since he assumed leadership of the party with mature and objective sense of judgment which he had garnered from many decades of meritorious service to both fatherland at all tiers of government and on the international plane where al Haji Bamanga Tukuru is a highly respected member of the international community with an impressive credential. The presence of Nigeria's First Lady, then Patience Goodluck Jonathan, who is the president of the African First Lady's Peace Mission and founder of the Arera Richard Foundation and Women for Change and Development Initiative, raised the level of the event. The First Lady was accompanied by the wife of the Vice President, Hajja Amina Namadi Sambo. The entire environment was completely taken over by women from every sphere of life who turned out in the different variants of the gold color chosen for the Fatima Bamanga Tuku at 50 event. The birthday girl, Princess Haji Chief Mrs. Fatima Bamanga Tukuru, deserves her collective praise for the attention she has given to the plight of the less privileged and the downtrodden in the society even in the euphoria of the celebration of her Golden Jubilee. A major plank of her Golden Jubilee celebration was the launching of the Crying Child Foundation. The Crying Child Foundation is out to join efforts with other organizations and governmental agencies to alleviate the suffering of the Nigerian child. Trafficking in girls for commercial sexual exploitation and the young boys who should be in school forced into hawking on the streets. Children under 15 years, according to UNICEF, account for 45% of Nigeria's population and 40% of Nigerian children between 6 and 11 years do not have access to primary school education. The figures show that 16 million children are not enrolled in schools, while 10 million others lack access to education. These are indeed very frightening figures. Children, mostly in the northern part of the country, are vulnerable to poverty and insecurity. Born 50 years ago to parents who hailed from Baramatu Kingdom in the Niger Delta region, Hajia Fatima Bamanga Tukuru, who attended Corona Nursery School, Ireti Primary School, Methodist Girls High School, and Ikoi School of Nursing Lagos, also attended the American College London and the Paris Fashion College, where she majored in the art of physiotherapy. Growing up with her grandmother, imbued in her the love for humanity and the milk of human kindness, this she is now brought to the fore with the launch of the Caring Child Foundation. The chairman of the occasion and governor of Abia State Chief Theodore Oji, who began by congratulating the birthday girl, Hajja Fatima Bamanga Tukur, also praised her vision and foresight in embracing the less privileged in the society and urged others to take a cue from what he called a well-thought-out initiative. To be the chairman of an occasion that has a great man behind it is not easy. 
the first thing I have to do is to welcome every person who has come here to celebrate and felicitate with the wife of the chairman of our great party, the BDP, Akia Fatima Amanga Atoko. I welcome you sincerely. All those who spoke at the event, which included Senator Grace Folasha de Bent, CON, former Deputy Senate President, Senator Ibrahim Mantu, CFR, and others from the home front of Hajia Fatima Bamanga Tukru, led by King AJ Turner, the Obigbo Miki Miki of Okuma Kingdom, and the sisters of the celebrant, traced the history of her love for children and her kind hearted nature toward childhood. They all congratulated her for making the plight of the less privileged her major concern at a time when she should be popping champagne and felicitating. They urged others who are well to do to also embrace such humanitarian gestures. Today is your day. This is the day that the Lord has made. And we all rejoice and we are glad in it. Congratulations. Hajiya Fatima. You're 50 today. It's not by your own power. This is the doing of the Lord. And you have to make sure that her husband is not only the chairman of the Christian Party in black and white Africa, but the most nourished and the best dressed. So when those of us who are very close to the chairman describe Angie Afati as the chairman's doing of inestimable value, we are referring to the catalog of goodies she has brought to his life. Hajia Fati is exceptionally talented, who is, she is always ready with solutions to all problems. And you will agree with me that we have had quite a number of programs of research. We have uh, every reason to be proud of her. We have every reason to also be proud of the husband. She has uh, made a very good family. And that family is a Bayesa family. And we wish her many more years of this nature and we also wish the husband many more years. So to our little sister Florence, I want to say happy birthday to you. You deserve to be happy. You deserve all the happiness in this world. You have done well for yourself, you've done well for your family, you've done well for your friends. You give even when you don't have. Everything she has, she gives out. So please, Nigerians, help me pray for Hajia Fatima Bamanga Tukum for long life, prosperity. Hajia Fatima Bamanga Tukum is my little sister, and we lived together in the police barracks. When the husband said he was coming to marry her. I was like, is it possible? Why? Because Ajia is a very caring person. In fact, cook food that will last me for a month in my fridge. So believe you me, I was crying that she was leaving. But I'm happy that she's in the good hands. I'm happy that she found joy at the end of the day. Daddy, I say thank you. Thank you for bringing my sister to this stage she has gone to. There was a performance by the children of the Crying Child Foundation made up mainly of children from different schools around the country. This is followed by another performance by KC. This got the audience dancing and the celebration mood taken to greater height.
The Celebrant caught her birthday cake in the midst of some dignitaries and posted an extensive photo session with all of them. The King of World Beats, King Sonia, the entertainer birthday girl, who was led to the stage by the First Lady, Dame Patience Goodluck Jonathan. In her remarks, as a special guest of honor at the 50th birthday anniversary celebration of the princess from the Niger Delta region, Hajar Fatima Bamanga Tukuru, the First Lady urged more people to be involved in the plight of the children, as government alone cannot solve all problems. She also appealed to all well-meaning people in society to lend a helping hand to the founder of the Crying Child Foundation through monetary assistance and other forms. Ajia Tuko is well known as a dedicated mother, dutiful wife, and philanthropist. She is also known to us all as an in invaluable rock of support of the respected elder statesman and national chairman of our great party, PDP, Alaji Bamangati. It is also not surprising that Archie and Fatima are choosing this special occasion of her 50th birthday anniversary to officially launch her entry, the Crying Child Foundation. Yeah. This is why Almighty Allah, in His infinite mercies, has continued to shower His blessings on Archie and Fatima to and the formal launching of the foundation was flagged off by the chairman of the occasion, Abia State Governor Chief Theodore Oji, who announced the donation of PDP Governor's Forum. Governor Theodore Oji's personal donation and that of the Bayasa State Governor, Sireke Dixon, opened the floodgates of more donations for the Crying Child Foundation. It attracted a widespread participation from friends of the birthday girl and her husband. Alhaji Bamanga Tukuru, PDP National Chairman. The vote of thanks was given by Yeye Bola Dari, Chairperson of the Planning Committee of the Fatima Bamanga Tukuru 50 Birthday Party. The last item on the card was the performance by King Somniade as a celebrant and her friends took to the dancing floor. <laughs> It's hearty congratulations to the princess, an amazing amazon from the Niger Delta region, Haja Fatima Bamanga Tukuru. For celebrating 50 years with the less privileged in this society.